canvassing field is in need of recruits. Those who engage in this work in the spirit of the master will find entrance to the homes of those who need the truth. To these, they can tell the simple story of the cross, and God will strengthen and bless them as they lead others to the light. The righteousness of Christ goes before them, and the glory of God is their reward. The Review and Herald, June 16, 1903. The Espinoza family felt this calling and decided to respond. We received our calling at the Woodbridge Church. It was there that the pastor said he needed call porters. It just so happened that I didn't have a job. So I said to my wife, you've call ported before, why don't we do it? I also told one of my co-workers that I was going to start selling Bibles. She said she didn't have one and that as soon as I had one, she would be the first one to buy it. After deciding to colport, the Espinoza family went to Seda to receive training and meet other colporters. It was a beautiful experience to listen and to share with other brethren their experience and the experiences they are living. We have learned a lot from them and they have helped us continue on the Lord's path. When we go canvassing, it usually is my daughter and I. We go out of the neighborhood with our truck. We leave this neighborhood for my wife because there are many apartments here and she can walk since she doesn't drive. My daughter helps me. When I'm forgetting something, she tells me, Daddy, don't forget this or remember to tell them that. She helps me with reaching out to the kids and she has sold several Bibles all by herself. I take my Bible to, to school and I put it in my backpack and then I show it to my friends so they can learn about God. And when I go out with my daddy, I help him when he forgets things. As they go about canvassing, they feel God working through them to reach people for the kingdom. When you canvass, there are a lot of experiences and you feel God's hand guiding you. You don't speak your own words, but they are inspired by the Holy Spirit. There are many people who want to know about Jesus and they have no way of knowing. I've gone to houses where they have begun to read the Bible, to know more, and they are very happy. Brothers, there are many houses left. We hope that you will help us because that is what Jesus wants us to do so he can come back soon.